The Grouchy Ladybug A story by Eric Carl It was night and some fireflies danced around the moon. At 5 o'clock in the morning, the sun came up. A friendly ladybug flew in from the left. It saw a leaf with many aphids on it and decided to have them for breakfast. But just then, a grouchy ladybug flew in from the right. It too saw the aphids and wanted them for breakfast. Good morning! Go away! I want those aphids! We can share them! No! They're mine! All mine! Screamed the grouchy ladybug. Or do you want to fight me for them? If you insist! Answered the friendly ladybug sweetly. It looked at the other bug straight in the eye. The grouchy ladybug stepped back. It looked less sure of itself. Oh, you're not big enough for me to fight. Then why don't you pick on somebody bigger? I'll do that. I'll show you. The grouchy ladybug puffed itself up and flew off. At 6 o'clock, it met a yellow jacket. Hey you! said the grouchy ladybug. Want to fight? If you insist! said the yellow jacket showing its stinger. Oh! You're not big enough, said the grouchy ladybug and flew off. At 7 o'clock, it met a stag beetle. Hey you, said the grouchy ladybug. Want to fight? If you insist, said the stag beetle opening its jaws. Oh, you're not big enough, said the grouchy ladybug and flew off. At 8 o'clock, it came across a praying mantis. Hey you, said the grouchy ladybug. Want to fight? If you insist, said the praying mantis reaching out with its front legs. Oh, you're not big enough, said the grouchy ladybug. At nine o'clock, it almost flew into a sparrow. Hey you, said the grouchy ladybug. Want to fight? If you insist, said the sparrow, opening its sharp beak. Oh, you're not big enough said the grouchy ladybug and flew off. At 10 o'clock, it saw a lobster. Hey you! said the grouchy ladybug. Want to fight? If you insist! said the lobster, stretching its claws. Oh, you're not big enough! said the grouchy ladybug and flew off. At 11 o'clock, it bumped into a skunk. Hey you! said the grouchy ladybug. Want to fight? If you insist! said the skunk, starting to lift its tail. Oh, you're not big enough! said the grouchy ladybug and flew off. At 12 noon, it spotted a boa constrictor. Hey you! said the grouchy ladybug. Want to fight? If you insist! said the snake. 
Right after lunch. Oh, you're not big enough, said the grouchy ladybug and flew off. At one o'clock, it happened upon a hyena. Hey, you! said the grouchy ladybug. Want to fight? If you insist, <laughs> said the hyena, laughing and showing its teeth. Oh, you're not big enough, said the grouchy ladybug and flew off. At two o'clock, it met a gorilla. Hey, you! said the grouchy ladybug. Want to fight? If you insist, said the gorilla, beating its chest. Oh, you're not big enough, said the grouchy ladybug and flew off. At three o'clock, it ran into a rhinoceros. Hey, you! said the grouchy ladybug. Want to fight? If you insist, said the rhinoceros, lowering its horn. Oh, you're not big enough, said the grouchy ladybug and flew off. At four o'clock, it encountered an elephant. Hey, you! said the grouchy ladybug. Want to fight? If you insist, said the elephant, raising its big tusk. Oh, you're not big enough, said the grouchy ladybug and flew off. At five o'clock, it met a whale. Hey, you, said the grouchy ladybug. Want to fight? But the whale did not answer at all. You're not big enough anyway, said the grouchy ladybug and flew off. At 5.15, the grouchy ladybug said to one of the whale's flippers, Hey, you! Want to fight? But it got no answer, so it flew away. At 5.30, the grouchy ladybug said to the whale's fin, Hey, you! Want to fight? But got no answer, so it flew away. At 6 o'clock, the grouchy ladybug arrived right back where it had started. At a quarter to 6, the grouchy ladybug said to the whale's tail, Hey, you! Want to fight? And the whale's tail gave the grouchy ladybug such a slap that it flew across the sea and across the land. Ah, here you are again. You must be hungry. There are some aphids left. You can have them for dinner. Oh, thank you. Soon, all the aphids were gone. Thank you, said the leaf. You are welcome, answered both ladybugs, and they went to sleep. The fireflies, who had been sleeping all day, came out to dance around the moon. The End
If this is your first time to visit my channel, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell for you to get updated of the latest educational videos that I am going to upload.